Hey YouTube, it's Asus once again. I'm doing more videos because I have time and I can and I haven't done a lot in a while so I thought I'd build them up so that I can do a bunch of them and spread them out over time so I don't have to worry about filming things. <laughs> so uh, I am coming to you today with an Ipsy bag review. Well, unbagging, even though I've already unbagged this. I've had actually a problem this time. Well, this is a November bag, and the only reason why it's so late is because I I don't know what happened, but apparently I didn't get it. Get, oh my goodness. Apparently I didn't get mine in the mail. Um, I'm not quite sure why. I've always gotten it in the mail in the past just fine, ever since I started getting this in, I think it was July, I think I started getting this, and I never had any problems before. This is the first time I've had an issue with not receiving my bag, but I contacted customer service. They were very, very prompt <clears throat> excuse me, with their response, and they were more than happy to send me another bag. Um, understandably, they said they could only send me one bag as a replacement, so they needed to make sure I had all my address and everything right, so I made sure that it was correct, and I received my bag like I was supposed to, so I'm not sure what the problem was. I'm pretty sure someone might have taken it. The, pack the outside packaging is pretty flashy, so I can see how it's tempting to want to steal something like that, but anyway. So this is the November bag, and it's very nice gold print. Uh, I really am liking the quality of the bags now. Um, and in the beginning, I wasn't too thrilled about the quality, but now I'm really, really liking the quality of the bags. Um, and they're nice and big too. I really like how big they are as well. So this has like a nice fuchsia pink detailing on the inside, and here's all the things that I get. And I got a lot of things this time. I don't know. It seems like I got more than I usually get. I got six items this time. I usually, I think I usually only get five, but I'm not quite sure. So the whoa. Every video, every video, I seem to drop things. Okay. The first thing I have is something that I've heard about. It's um, nail teeny, and I guess it's a nail polish, but. Um, I've heard good things about Nail Teeny, I suppose. I don't know. I've heard of them. I don't know where, but I've heard of this brand. But um, it's this really pretty silver. And it's just like a frost silver. And it's different than what I have on. It's a little bit lighter. But I like it. And I think I will really, really like wearing it during the winter time because I like silver. And I think silver looks good in the winter. So next thing I have is from a brand that I've never heard of before. It's uh, Kaylin, I think. Kaylin? It's um, this eyeshadow, and it's a very interesting concept of how it's dispensed. It's, uh, I believe it's a pigment eyeshadow, and it's a really pretty pale gold. But what you do is you go like this, and it comes off on this little sponge, which I really like, actually. So let me put some on my hand for you. So there it is. It's a really pretty pale gold. It looked really good during Christmas time and the holidays and the winter time. I really like this gold. I usually am not a fan of gold, but I like pale gold. So I think I like wearing this. And I like how it's dispensed. I usually don't like pigments just because they're messy and I don't have the right brushes for that, for pigments. So I like how this is set up. So, um,. Yeah. Next item I have is a pixie item, which I was kind of really excited about because I know I've seen pixie at Target before and they're usually pretty expensive. So this is a bronzer and I'm not sure the shade, it doesn't, I don't think it says, but um, it's a matte bronzer and it's a pretty light one too, which is good because I have um, light skin. So um, it seems really good quality. I haven't used it really for anything but it would be really good for like a contour I think maybe like a really subtle contour because this is pretty light but 
I don't know. I like it. I really think it's good quality. And um, the only thing I wish is, I don't know if it's just because it's really light, but I kind of wish it was a little bit more pigmented. Um, but yeah, otherwise, I'm excited to try, try it out some more and see how well it does. All right, next is a lip crayon, and it's from Be A Bombshell, and it's the shade Shameless, and it's a really pretty, actually, you know what, I'll just show you here first. It's a really pretty red, and I like it. It's really nice, and I will show you what that looks like. It's a very pretty pink red, and I am very happy about that because I like it. It I've tried this out already and it's um it comes off easily but that's to be expected for a the pen uh, stick thing. So yeah. Next is the Star Looks uh, eyeliner pencil and it is a really pretty silver color. And I like silver. Silver is so pretty and amazing. And it's just gorgeous. I probably won't really be using it because I don't know. I'm not a fan of silver, really, on my eyes at least. I like wearing it for jewelry, but not really on my skin tone. And then the last item I got, I was a little surprised by because, I mean, I'm not absolutely surprised but for how much this stuff costs um m cosmetics i i got something from m cosmetics as you guys know um or may not know m cosmetics is a company from a uh youtube um someone from youtube who started her own makeup line and m stands for well m is michelle fun Clearly. I follow her on YouTube. I love her makeup videos. Her makeup videos uh, are one of the her. She's one of the people that do inspire me to make these kinds of videos. Um, you know the beauty related videos. She's one of the first people that I started watching on YouTube. So she's very inspirational to me. And to get something from her line to try out, I know it's from Ipsy, but I mean I just think it's really special that I get to try that to try something from a fellow YouTuber who has come so far in what she wants to do in her life and um, I support anyone who want, who you know is looking to start their own business and do you know that kind of thing so yay congratulations Michelle for your makeup line I'm really happy for you but back to my thing. So I got one of her lipsticks and I have to say the quality is absolutely amazing. I love it. It smells really good. It smells like sugary uh, candy, baked goods. I don't know. But um, I'm so sorry. Again, I can't really see the uh, thing. But um, here's the color. It's a it's really pretty like rosy uh, pink. And it's, um, I'm not quite sure what season I would qualify this for. Um, rosy pink. It, 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 mm, it looks like a whole, it looks like a year round kind of color, actually, to be honest. And I really, really like it. And I am very excited to wear this. I haven't worn it yet, but I most likely will in the near future so I'm excited about that and I know her lipsticks run a little more expensive because I believe her price range is considered a higher end brand but um which is even more why I'm excited to try it because I've never really tried a high a high end makeup before so it's kind of exciting but anyway um her packaging is really nice as well it's simple and it's um it has a good weight to it so i'm excited to try it so yay um and that's all i have for my ipsy bag this month i will continue to get these because i really like ipsy i each month seems to you know have better and better stuff in it and um 
you know, stuff that I find myself actually using. Um, when I was using Beauty Army, I wasn't really using the stuff that they gave me, but this stuff, I feel, I, I mean, I really do use it, and I really do like it, and I love the bags. I love that there's something that you can actually just keep and, you know, just, you know, just collect the bags and use them for whatever you want to use them as. But, yeah, I've been really loving the service, and I highly suggest the service. It's only $10 a month, and you get all these really cool um, items like I've just shown. So I highly recommend them and if you would like to join Ipsy and get your own bags you can go to their website and sign up and I'm not getting paid to endorse them or anything. I buy this with my own money and I review them because I would like other people to know about it because it's actually a really good service. So if you want to go get your own bags, links down below, like always, please like and subscribe my video and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.